Andrew Nielsen, congratulations on the OT win. Can you take us through that play? Yeah, it was just kind of a nice, nice pass and play. We had a couple of looks at the start, and um, we didn't really get anything to the net. Um, so I just thought I'd throw it on net and went off a stick. And luckily, there was a good screen. He didn't see anything of it, so just kind of floated in. Not one of the nicest goals, but it counts. The Toronto Marlies getting off to a slower start today. You know, what do you think credited that? Like, uh, getting into the second period, you guys then got on the board. What do you think the slow start was all about for you guys? I don't know. I mean, I think we just kind of came out a little lethargic and, and not ready to go. And it took us a good 20 minutes to kind of get going. And um, once we uh, once we came back and regrouped in, in, in the first intermission, I thought we were we were better. We were getting pucks deep and, and playing our game fast, fast, hard hockey. And um, that's what we got to do for a full 60. The power play really dominant for the Marlies. We saw it start off in the overtime uh, here today. What do you think you know contributes to that power play and what makes it so dominant? I think just the skill we have on it. We got a lot of a lot of skilled guys on both units and um, everyone can see the ice really well and we got some heavy shots and um, we, got, we got guys that are willing to go to the net. So um, if we're not going to score a pretty one, we're going to score a greasy one. So um, when we can continue to get pucks to the net and, and traffic there, we're going we're gonna to keep scoring goals. One road game on the Marley schedule so far, now six in a row to go. What can we expect from the Toronto Marlies? What are you guys going to take from your home dominance and apply to the road? Just the same thing. I mean, it um, doesn't matter where we play. It's just the same kind of game, and um, we're going to continue to work hard and, and, like I said, get pucks deep and, and play hard hockey. So um, we're going to keep rolling here and, and, and keep gelling as a team, and it'll be good to get on the road for, for a week or so and, and, and get closer and um, kind of come together as a team more. And, um, only going to benefit us, and, and we're just going to keep going. Six points in six games played. What's working for you so far this season? I think I'm just I'm just shooting pucks more and, and joining the play and, and and benefiting from the system we play. Maybe we play a fast, a fast skilled game, and um, when you get the pucks up to the forwards and and they create time and space with their speed, it's easy to to join the rush and and and, and be that fourth layer like we like we like to have. So um, playing power play helps too, and. Um, and like I said, I'm just going to continue to put Pox to the net and, and get it in the hands of the school forwards and, and things are going to keep going. How has playing with Campbell sort of helped your transition? Obviously, he's a pretty veteran guy. Um, I think it's been pretty easy. I mean, Soup, he's a, um, like you said, a veteran in this league and, and in the NHL too. And um, he knows what it takes. And um, I'm just kind of trying to soak as much as I can in and, and, and lean on him for, for a lot of things. And um, he's been really, really beneficial for, for my off ice too. And, um, He's been great not only for me but for, for another younger guy like Derms and, and lots, lots of us. So we're just going to continue to, to try to gel as a, as a pair and um, keep rolling as a group. Antoine Bebo getting the last three starts and really standing on his head for you guys. Can you just touch on his play so far and what you thought of it? Bebo's been great. I mean, he's, he's a good goalie and he's big and he's athletic and um, he keeps us in it when, when, when we're not playing. I mean, that first period, it could have been easily three or four nothing. And he made a couple key saves that kept us in the game and allowed us to come back in the second. So. Um, him and Sparksy and, and Glasser are, are, are huge pieces to our team, and, and we're confident with whoever we have in, in, the, in the net. So um, when, when, when they're going, we're going. So it's, uh, it's, a, good, it's a good combination.